So excited to be restoring this old grain shed. Such a beautiful old building. And instead of tearing it down, I'm gonna turn it into my chicken coop. So floors, they've gotta be fixed. The doors gotta be put on. And lots of to do in here, old grain bags. But look at that old wood, isn't that cool? the old grain all over the floor. I'm thinking there's a nice wood, hopefully, floor under here. I'm gonna clean that all up. And over here I want to show you, it looks like the old electric that was in the barn. Isn't that cool? This barn doesn't have any electric right now. But anyway, so I'm gonna be redoing this old barn and changing it into my chicken coop and saving it from being torn down. So hopefully y'all enjoy the videos I share as I go along. Out here I'm going to put some rocks, make a little walkway. As you can see, there's a bit of old cement rock there. And then a lot of the roof is coming off. We're gonna have to re-screw that on. As you can see, it looks like this building was originally old shake shingles there but then the old metal has been put on it now. Y'all here at the back, look at that, the old foundation. Rocks, isn't that cool? <laughs> so yeah, there's some boards that need retacked and all back here, but I'm gonna have my pin come out of the back here and some wire so that they can come out in the sunshine, so. Yep. So progress on the chicken coop. We cut out the board that went across the floor there. And we cut this out. This will be the doorway for the chicken coop. This will be where I keep the feed. And then um, looks like we're gonna have to do some repair here. Some of the boards have come loose and down here at the bottom, you can see the board coming down. It'll focus there. And then a little up here, it needs to be nailed back in. But yeah, this is the progress we've got done so far. To give y'all a quick little update on the chicken goop, I haven't had much time to work on it, but I did get the rock walkway finished and I just planted this uh, peppermint it has a little bit of pansies or some pretty little flower in it my um, friend gave me these so I used an old mineral tub and put that by the door and then I have had a chance to but just got started on the wire so it's still not nailed down but yep it's coming along slowly but surely Wanted to give y'all an update on the chicken coop. I'm moving them in today. So, um, I found this shovel and this pitchfork at a yard sale today. So just exactly what I was needing. So I was excited about that. But um, I've got the door on, latch in. Um, I'm gonna put the water there, try to keep it out of the bedding. I've got their food hanging, so it's off the ground so that they don't get shavings and mess all in it. And then I can lengthen it up higher as they grow. Um, I have the nesting boxes here, but I'm gonna put a board over them until they're old enough to lay, so I don't have to keep those cleaned out. And then I've got the roost low for how small they are, and then a heat lamp. Um, they're in Montana's turn from spring to summer really quick here, but the nights are still pretty cool. So, um, and then you can see the door there. And then this will be my feed area. I am gonna have shavings and, or the bedding in one and feed in the other. And then I went ahead and cut this board out and I'm gonna have it where I can get their eggs out really easy or clean their nesting box. So one other thing is their 
door there. I have it rigged here where I let this off. That way I don't have to go inside every time to open the door. I can just open it from the outside. So I'm fixing to go get them out of the basement. They're big enough to put in their new cage. And I'm gonna put them in and see how it goes. Well, they're in their new home, but they're a little unsure. So much bigger than their other box. So we're finishing up the outside of the pen. The chickens are big enough now that they need to be able to come outside. We have wire all the way up and we have a couple layers of wood up from the bottom and then we are putting old tin roofing on the top. They'll get plenty of sunlight through the sides of the wire, but they will be safe from outside predators. I have a ramp for the chickens to come in and out during the day and then if I need to I can shut that door that I showed you inside to close off their outside pen. Here's a few shots from inside. I have the nesting boxes ready and the chickens are mighty happy.